the channel. Today I have another episode of Vlogmas for 2023 and we are having a baking day. So a few weeks ago I posted, may have been a month ago now, I posted a little um, home goods haul and I got these great disposable um, like cookie tins but they are paper and there's boxes and then there's buckets. So I'm not sure if I'm going to use both. I originally bought a bunch of both because I thought I would do a whole big baking day for a friend and I would need both containers for each family, but I've really narrowed it down and minimalized it because it's Monday, December 18th, and we just got home Friday night from Europe. We have four Christmas events this weekend, as well as Luke and my brother went to a football game, and so there just hasn't been any time, and all of our friends that we're giving these to are in our church life group, which is tonight and if we don't get them out tonight luke and i will be driving around to everyone's house to deliver which could be fun but time is just of the essence so we're not doing as much but i've been to the store this morning got all the things and we're gonna bake today so this is what our stash is looking like first we have regular chocolate chips and then we have a bunch of white chocolate chips which i'm going to be melting over the stove in a double boiler to dip things in this is a hack that i saw a few years ago and it's amazing. You can use a tablespoon of coconut oil in your double boiler with this stuff and it makes it where it adheres to whatever you're dipping it in so much better. Um, it just makes it really good for dipping. Instead of having to use like a paraffin block, you can use coconut oil. So got that. We got a big jar of peanut butter because two of the four cookies we're making involve peanut butter. Got a sleeve of, or not a sleeve, but a pack of Oreos, a whole box of Ritz crackers big thing of powdered sugar i don't even know if i need this much but i just grabbed what i could find and then some um sprinkles slash sanding sugar uh i'm not really sure like how i'm gonna do sprinkles today but got some of those they didn't have really any festive ones so we're gonna see but let's go ahead and get started on our baking day it's cold outside keeps us warm we can spend the night underneath the mistletoe and i've gotten you a present that i put under the tree tomorrow it is christmas the first for you and me the snow is falling down and the storm is on its way but as long as you're around Everything will be okay Cause all I wanna do is spend this holiday with you Tomorrow it is Christmas The first for me and you I longed for this moment To have you for myself In a cabin out of nowhere Just us and no one else I've decorated Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. Another year went by, but the difference this time is that ever since July, I've been happier than I have ever been. It's safe to say that my love for you is true. Tomorrow it is Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed 
So we have officially like made everything basically. I just put the little like break and bake Pillsbury cookies in the oven and that's the last thing I have. So cleaned up a little bit and I'm super tired, but that I is still young and I have a lot to do. So I wanted to go ahead and show you the little name tags that I printed for these and I'll show you the tins again, or they're not tins, but like the paper boxes, the little goodie boxes in case you missed that little video. But I saw these and I thought these were so fun and I just like put the last name of the family on there. I'm going to use some string, I think, and like tie around the box and then like fish this through it and put the bow on top. But this is just a cute little like way to personalize it, but also so people remember if they've gotten theirs or not. So <laughs> I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna show you those little boxes and then the cookies will be about ready to come out and cool and hopefully everything's like adhered and hardened and dried enough. I really hope I don't have like gooey wet chocolate still when it's time to box these things up. Okay, so these are the first ones. I love a pink and red and white like Christmas theme. I just love that so much. This is like the perfect Christmas design in my opinion. It's this super light baby pink. It has candy canes, it has peppermint, and it has little gingerbread men on it. So, so cute. I got these at um, Home Goods. And it's a set of six. It's this My Mind's Eye brand. This brand gets me in trouble all the time because they make the cutest little like muffin and cupcake holders and just all their little paper, like festive party paper good things. I love, but highly recommend this brand. And it was $6 for the set of six boxes, which is way better than if you get the like reusable true tin cookie holders. Um, those get very expensive. And then here's the second box. I think it like complements it so well, but it's red and then it has little sugar cookies iced in pink frosting and little um, like glass bottles of milk jars. So these are just absolute perfection. <laughs> All right guys, well that is it for this vlog. Everything turned out great. I hope our friends enjoy it. And I have plenty left over to share, so I'm gonna be figuring out where to take those this week. But I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.